guys so i'm currently in london i just came here from paris yesterday i've been in paris for the last month doing study abroad and i figured that if i'm here in europe i might as well visit london because i have family here i have a brother that i never met before and i really wanted to and i just like london it's somewhere that i've always wanted to visit so i figured why not so i'm here guys i'm so excited i don't have any set plans i'm just kind of going with the flow right now i'm about to head out and go explore the city a little bit so let's go explore london like i said i didn't have any set plans i was kind of just going with the flow on the first day i went to westfield which is a mall in london they had this store called american candy which literally has all of the candy and snacks that you will find in america i found out that they don't really sell them in the stores in london so they have a store actually dedicated to this and i didn't buy anything i just kind of went in for the optics but i thought it was really cool i hit the food court and i got some popeyes because i didn't have a lot of meat when i was in paris i didn't have a lot of chicken i didn't have a lot of fried food and i didn't really have a lot of food that was like really seasoned like how we season it in america so i was craving that and then after that i just walked around london i walked to the museum of london and got tickets to see the museum and i learned a lot about london's history and after that i walked around some more and i ended up visiting the come de garçon store that they have here the dover street market and it was really cool but the next day i went to grounded which is this restaurant i had some cauliflower wings and then i also had a burger and fries which was really good i felt kind of weird eating by myself i never really done that before and then i went to little china little asia little china or what do they call it china street chinatown i went to chinatown you guys and i picked up some like seaweed and mochi i never had mochi before after that i went to little venice and they have this like canal type thing and i sat and fed the ducks i gave them the rest of my cauliflower wings and they loved it so much like you guys could see them just like flocking to where i was throwing the food in and after that i just went and sat in the park right across the street and i I ate my mochi in peace while kind of watching the canal like the lake area and it was really interesting the mochi that i got i got ice cream mochi and then i also got the regular mochi with it's like beans on the inside so it was really interesting this view this view is so nice where oh oh up there oh is that what we're getting on no oh <laughs> So this is where the Prime Minister lives. He lives like all the way in the back. So we're just walking by. I don't think anybody can actually like get in. Of course people want to come take like photos and stuff. We're at the Buckingham Palace right now. It's actually so crazy being in a country that still is ruled by a queen because as you guys know it is not like this in america so it's just really really interesting and the fact that we could actually get so close to the palace i don't know why i thought that we could actually like go inside and take a tour of it 
that it was just open to the public, but of course it's not. What's up? Say hey to the queen, guys. <laughs>